Good evening. So for story time, Connor and I are reading I Love You Forever by Robert Munch. We hope you enjoy it. A mother held her new baby and very slowly rocked him back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And while she held him, she sang, I love you forever, I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. That baby grew, he grew, and he grew, and he grew. He grew until he was two years old, and he ran all around the house. He pulled all the books out of the shelves, he pulled all the food out of the fridge, and he took his mother's watch and flushed it down the toilet. Sometimes the mother would yell, This child is driving me crazy! But at night time, when that two-year-old was quiet, she opened the door to her room, tiptoed across the floor and looked down at his bed. If he was really asleep, she picked him up and rocked him back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, and sang, I'll love you forever, I'll like you for always, as long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. That little boy grew, he grew, and he grew, and he grew, he grew until he was eight years old, and he never wanted to come in for dinner, and he never wanted to take a bath, and when Grandma visited, he sometimes said bad words at the dinner table. Yeah, Dinner's ready. Sometimes the mother wanted to sell him to the zoo. But at night time, when he was asleep, the mother quietly opened the door to his room, crawled across the floor, and looked up over the side of the bed. If he was really asleep, she picked up that eight-year-old boy and rocked him back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And while she rocked him, she sang... I'll love you forever, I'll like you for always, as long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. The boy grew, and he grew, and he grew, and he grew, until he was a teenager. He wore strange clothes and had strange friends and listened to strange music. Sometimes his mother felt like she was in a zoo. But at night, his mother opened the door to his room, crept across the floor and looked down at the bed. If that teenager was really asleep, she kissed him on the cheek and sang, I'll love you forever, I'll like you for always, as long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. Well, that teenager grew, and he grew, and he grew, and he grew until he was a grown-up man. He left home and got a flat on the other side of town. But sometimes on dark nights, the mother took a bus across town. If all the lights in her son's house were out, she let herself in tiptoed upstairs and looked at the bed. If that great big man was really asleep, she kissed him on the cheek and whispered, I'll love you forever, I'll like you for always, as long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. Well, that mother got older. She got older and older and older. One day she called up her son and said, you better come and see me because I'm really old and sick. So the son went to see his mother and when he came in the door, she tried to sing the song. I love you forever, I like you, but she was too old and sick to finish the song. The son went to his mother, hugged her, and rocked her back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, and sang, I love you forever, I like you for always, as long as I'm living, my mother, you'll be. When the son came home that night, he stood for a long time at the top of the stairs, then he went into the room where his new baby daughter was sleeping. He picked her up and rocked her back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, and sang, I love you forever, I like you for always, as long as I'm living, my baby, you'll be.